Guys, come on. Hey, Dad. You're off her. June, can you move, please? So today is our first nice warm day in about three weeks or so. We had a nice bit of warm weather for about a week and then it went back down to freezing and below freezing for about three weeks. So today we're getting out and doing a few farm chores and you can see the goats are definitely happy that we're down hanging out with them. that it's getting into springtime it's pretty important that you try to get as much stuff taken care of as you need to get ready for the summer months So where are we putting in that? Baking soda and goat minerals. What's the baking soda for? So they can um they kind of self dose it after they have eaten a lot of hay to help them not get. <laughs> what do you think about it, Willie? That is awful intriguing what you're doing. <laughs> so is that is that stuff basically like the mineral block except not in block form? Yeah. It's easier. Is that easier for them to eat or just digest? Yeah, it is. Plus, this one contains ammonium chloride, which if you have a buck or a weather and you're feeding them grain, it helps them to not develop calculi, which can give them kidney stones, which can kill them. Oh, that's no good. Nope. We don't want Willie and Hank to die. You can see the chickens living. We don't want to die. Mm -hmm. Whoa, coming in hot. Ooh, Hagrid. And they're off. <laughs> Hot. I think Hagrid won the race. What is it down here that's so enticing? I think Hagrid won you guys. And then here comes Pua. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, she can barely stop. Pull yourself over, girlfriend. Come on. Come on, Miss Piggy. You guys are just so intrigued today, huh? Which one is that, Ron or Harry? Harry. 
Oh, they're getting bass. I guess it's about time that we need to start doing their wallering hole again. It is pretty warm today. If you just let me fill this bucket up, I'll curl up your bowl. Come over here and get a bath. Come over here and get a bath. I'm Harry. Harry. Get a Harry. Guys, don't, don't do it. <laughs> He's there. Wait Guys, uh, come on now. I need that. Guys. <laughs> it's not for you guys. And now it's on Yeah, I wanted a nice, cool bath. So one of the things about pigs is that they don't have the same type of sweat glands that humans have. So uh, it's important for them to be able to cool down. And one of the ways that they cool down is through evaporation with the water or mud evaporating off their skin or panting like dogs. Just give them a nice little, nice little spray down. It's a little warm outside today. First warm day we've had in like three weeks, I think. We probably just try to see if we can just start refilling it. I mean, we gotta get all that nonsense out of there. Well, no, I know, but look, it'll probably take some water. He's probably laying down in the feet. Oh no, he's over there playing. He's going to go play in the sprinkler. What you guys think? Huh? Is it too warm out here for you guys today? We're going to see about getting that lawn hole all watered up. Poker's over there laying in the mud. She's heading for it. You're on the wrong side of the fence to be able to get it. Come over here, Harry. Tell you what, Ron is getting big. Ron's a big boy. He's thinking about it, and he's like, I don't know. There he goes. He's going. He's going. I can do it. I can do it. Maybe not. I'll just stop right here. Oh, nope, said, that's oh, too she's cold. Gonna pull me in and drown me. She's gonna drown me. I'm gonna die. What are you dragging that thing down here for? What? What are you doing with that thing? I'm gonna dig out that. No. Oh. What? I tell you, what might be easier is that uh, that tool that we use. Well, no, that 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 claw tool that we use uh, that I bought to clean this thing out. You know, it had the three three claws on the end of it. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, that might be easier to just grab. Are you seriously gonna dig this out? Oh, really? I mean, it is supposed to be like 87 tomorrow. Tie this end so you can get in this space and get out. 
<laughs> it took me and Emily like probably an hour to get that thing fi fixed back on this gate. Because yeah. we couldn't figure out like... We haven't figured out no, I know, but... Well, I tried to crawl under there. It's just... I'm trying to... I feel like I'm going to have heat hives. Well, that's every now and then you just take that hose and just sprinkle on yourself and you be done with it. It'll get you all nice and you cooled off. You grab the spade shovel, I'll help you while I can. Spade shovel? Yeah, the, the shovel small that, one? No, the spade shovel is the shovel that has the... Do you know where it is? Yeah, it's up there. I just used it. It's in the animal shed. I just used it to mix together in a grain. You're not supposed to be. Now you guys may be wondering why I'm not the one doing this, especially since it's my beautiful wife's birthday today, but um, I'm just getting over back surgery, so I'm not allowed to do anything. Not that they would let me do anything, but uh, that's why I'm not participating in the activities for today. I'm just being cameraman. I like to try to help out when I can, but I won't get to play this surgery card for much longer, so I can play it while I can, I guess. Ain't that right, babe? And you're 26 today, right? Yep. <laughs> Absolutely. What are you doing, Eli? You checking out what's going on over here? Eli is wondering where his wallowing hole is. You wanna go back, Dakota? You wanna go back in the creek? Come on. You can go back there and swim. about time that we need to start thinking about it. Coda likes to swim. Likes to play in the water. Yeah, I'll go back here with him. No, Eli, not you. Yeah, Eli, you definitely don't need to be back there. You keep hurting yourself with him. Oh, did you guys put these logs down here so people quit? Yeah, is that why you guys put the logs down there? Yeah. yeah. No, no, are you tired of Kaylee get, trying to get you in the water? No, you wait in the water and you lay down. Getting up back up. Not before flinging all his mud off. See if I can get over this log. Mm. Oh! Look at that smile. Look at that muddy smile. Hi. Say hi. That's a happy hoof. That's a happy hoof face. That's a happy hoof face. Oh, yeah. Oh. It might be still in the shop like in between the two garage doors. No, no, you didn't want to go swimming, huh? Come on, come on, bud. 
You lost your shoe in the mud there, Kaylee. Chicken boots. You're about to lose yourself in the mud. Nope. Come on, no, no. Curtis, what are you doing? We brought you back here so you could swim and enjoy the water. No, he's marking his territory. He's up to see the heat three times since he got back here. Five seconds. I guess he's trying to make his scent known so he can protect his no-no. No-no! He'll be fine, Curtis. Oh, what are you doing? Are you scratching your butt? Is that a good butt scratch? Oh yeah, scratch that head. Oh, what a silly boy you are. What a silly boy you are. You wanna go swim with Coda? Come on, no, no. Let's go swim with Coda. This used to be my garden. Used to be. But it didn't get enough sunlight. It got, it was perfect for what we needed it, but it didn't get enough sunlight in the right spots. So we came up with a mismatched garden. And then we had to move from the, we had to move the pigs from back there to right here. And yeah, that was the end of that. You didn't want to swim no more? This is where Nono's wallowing hole used to be, down here. But once we get this thing out, it'll probably be right here. I'm hoping that this whole root ball will not fall back down. We had a storm last year and the tree fell and it was held on by that tree up there and we had to come out here with some straps and some chains and pull it down by hand because it was stuck on the tree limbs up there. I'm hoping once we get it all cut, that the root ball doesn't come back down because this would be a perfect spot right down here on the bottom for a nice big wallowing hole for no-no. We really want to get this chain or the fence put back together between these two. That way this can be no-no's primary residency and have that be his wallowing hole. It's nice and cool down there. The dirt's real soft. It'll turn into a nice wallowing hole for him. He kinda, he's got that whole area back there for him to play in, but he primarily kinda sits up here next to, next to his ladies and his baby. He likes to have company. Let's see how the wallowing hole's coming up here. Hey, you Coda. Hurry up, Coda. Yeah, there. No no's coming. You can't let no no out. What are you guys talking about? Secret secrets are no fun unless you share with everyone. Haggard, you know that's your daddy right there, don't you? Daddy's telling mama, hey girl, you looking pretty fly over there. Nose touches for daddy. Nose touches for daddy. What you say, Eli? So Eli's got a big old bump on his face. 
Um, one of the reasons Eli's in here by himself is because he, he was moved back there with Nono and Polka for a while, but then Nono and him started fighting over food and he kept getting hurt and he got cut right there and we were giving him some antibiotics but it looks like it reopened up we need to start another round of antibiotics on him he stays hurting himself over something he's been by himself for like a month now and he still keeps hurting himself i think it's because he's reaching up over the fence over there trying to get that green stuff growing on the other side of the fence and he keeps hurting himself but he's our buck so we can't have him messing himself up or getting sick are we having goat story time over here Relax some with your babies. Willie, you're a, you're over a year old now, aren't you? Hey, I sure am. Me and Dolly. When's H Hank's birthday is coming up, isn't it? May 1st. Gross. Stop. I wanted to not have to change today. Stop. Coda. No, sir. Go see your mom over there. Thank you, Hank. Hank's the youngest one on the farm. Well, the youngest goat on the farm. And he's still attached to his mama's hip. So right here we got Etta, Dolly, Willie, Hank, June. Oh God! Uh oh. So what are you going to do with all that mud right there? I guess the chickens can enjoy that. I think it looks good. Now they just gotta remember it's there. Cool, decided to take a nap, so she'll probably find it when she's done. Poka! Poka, poka, poka! Look how I love, like, how shiny he looks when the sun reflects off of him. Here they come. Probably, it's probably still slightly too cold. He's like, that's chilly. Came out of uh, I'm laying there. So did I. Get in there, little pigs. See if you can swim. <laughs> Do the piggy backstroke. See, you dig something out, 
and they find one for themselves. That's animals. Fly, we got you. Lay down. Guys, I swear she's pregnant. She looks so pregnant. Little Hagrid. See if you can manage to get that thing tight again, babe. You look like you're doing a better job than it was in the first place. He said, you're doing a pretty good job, Mom. That looks better than what it started with. No, no, it's like, where's my wallowing hole? Where's my wallowing hole? You guys dug one for them. Where's mine? Big Papa needs his own wallowing hole. Ain't that right, bud? Ain't that right, no, no. You got So we got that project knocked off the list for now. Yesterday it had a high of, I think, 50. And then today was a high of... Today I want to believe the high is 79. And tomorrow it's... 87 the next day it's like 81 or something like that so it's kind of important for you to be able to get your pigs the availability to cool themselves off so it's good that we had the availability to get that knocked out today <laughs> 